Good morning, happy Easter, and welcome back, friends, to Children's Liturgy. Before we begin, let's gather the materials that we'll need for today's activity. For today, all you'll need is some paper, some coloring materials, some decorating materials such as stickers or ribbon, some tape, and glue. Are you ready to get started? All right, let's begin. Let us now make the sign of our faith. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Jesus, we thank you for the joy of the resurrection when you rose from the dead and were filled with new life. Help us to remember that you suffered and died on the cross for us, so that one day we too will share with you the joy of everlasting life. Amen. Today we celebrate Easter Sunday. On Easter Sunday, we celebrate the fact that Jesus has risen from the dead and is alive. As you walk into the church, you realize that something wonderful has happened. A large bright candle shines out for all to see and the church is decorated with beautiful flowers, a sign of new life. Today we will sing joyfully Alleluia, Alleluia as we thank God for Easter morning. Let us now prepare our hearts for the gospel. Christ is risen from the dead. You will see him as he said. A reading from the Gospel according to Mark. Glory to you, O Lord. On the first day of the week when the Sabbath was over, some of the women went to the tomb where Jesus was buried. The women's names were Mary Magdalene, Salome, and Mary the mother of James. They brought special oil with sweet spices in it, to put on Jesus' body. It was very early in the morning, just after the sun had risen, and one of the women asked, Who will roll away the huge stone from in front of the tomb for us? But when they got there, they saw that the stone had already been moved. The women went into the tomb and saw a man sitting on the right side. He was wearing a white robe. The women were afraid, but the man said, do not be afraid, you are looking for Jesus, the one who is crucified. He has risen. He is not here. Look, this is the place where he was buried. Now go and tell the disciples and Peter that Jesus is going to Galilee. Say to them, you will see him there just as he had told you. The women ran away from the tomb, but on the way they did not tell anyone what happened because they were afraid. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Why did Mary return to the tomb on Sunday morning? Jesus had died late on Friday afternoon, and the women had begun to embalm his body with spices and ointments in preparation for burial, as was their custom. However, the Jewish Sabbath began on sunset on the Friday evening, and work was not allowed on the Sabbath so they had to wait until Sunday to complete their task. What did Mary find when she arrived at the tomb? Whom did she tell? As the disciples ran to the tomb, can you imagine what they must have been thinking? Peter and John had raced to the tomb and found it empty. They could hardly believe that Jesus might be alive, but at that moment they began to hope that something as wonderful as this really could happen. On Easter Day and throughout the season of Easter, a special candle called the Paschal Candle is lit. What does it remind us of? It reminds us that Jesus, the light of the world, has destroyed death and is alive. It is a symbol of new life. What do we give to each other on Easter Sunday as symbols of new life? Easter eggs! Just as the chicken and egg must break free from its shell to begin a new life, so too Jesus had to break free from death in the tomb. He had the new life which God had promised to us all. For today's activity, we'll be making an Easter greeting card. On your greeting card, you can draw a picture of Jesus or symbols of new life such as the Paschal candle, some eggs, baby chickens, lambs, and flowers. You could also use stickers and ribbons to decorate your card. 
Don't forget to add words like Happy Easter or Jesus is Alive on your greeting card. When you're all done decorating your card, don't forget to give your card to someone you love. Let us now end today's liturgy in prayer. Loving Father, let the joy of Easter and the life we share help us to, be, to believe in you and follow you faithfully. We ask this through Christ our risen Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you so much, friends, for spending time with me at Children's Liturgy. I had a lot of fun learning about Jesus with you. I can't wait to spend some more time with you next week. So until then, God bless, and don't forget, God is good all the time. Bye! To think about the goodness of the Lord He gives me everything I need and so much more So I just want to lift my hands And say that I love Him I just want to lift my heart in praise And I want to be thankful I want to be grateful I want to remember everything That the Lord has done I want to be thankful I want to be grateful I want to be, I want to be, I want to be I like to think about the goodness of the Lord me everything I need and so much more. So I just want to lift my hands.